We are made up of the same exact stuff. We're made up of the universe. The universe is in us as we are part, as we are a part of the universe. We need zinc, iron, silver, coal. All right. We need all of these minerals. Some of these minerals we take. Contro controversy theory. We are made up of the same things that is in a cell phone. And uh, this is where it gets kind of crazy because you got to compare yourself to a cell phone. The cell phone's battery is a human's heart. Now, does the cell phone shit? Does the cell phone piss? No. Does the cell phone eat? It eats energy and it just dies out. So it converts his energy differently. We don't die every day and have need to be physically plugged in to work. We just need to go to sleep. But we're not dead. Maybe one can say that's the closest, the closest, the closest thing to death is sleep. Have you ever heard that saying before? So that is the difference between us and a cell phone. I mean, now, shit. Say if the cell phone got that AI and that AI were also to go into some robotics to deliver that cell phone off to a factory to make that cell phone some legs and an arm, arms, that's just one step closer for that once known object to become its own being. You know, what makes, man, I might need to roll up another, what makes a being, a being, we're a human being, whether you're trans, gay, black, white, over there, over here, they, them, X, Y, P, D, Q. At the end of the day, we still human beings. You know, monkeys, chimpanzees, Gorillas, giraffes, they're all of their own kind. Octopuses. They're all beings of their own species. But they're all made out of the same stuff as we are. Maybe different ways they have skin. 
They have muscle, gelatinous tissue, organs. They piss and shit. They have blood, eyes, ears, gills, maybe. But they're all made of the same stuff. The stuff of the universe. The stuff of the universe. And this universal stuff just landed on this rock and developed is like a sneeze. Is a is a universal sneeze onto a rock that has life. Maybe because the universe is alive. And if the universe is alive, then the universe has consciousness. Maybe it's not even a sneeze that landed on a rock. Maybe this whole rock is a part of the sneeze. One thing I don't really like about science is that they they easily easily wrap themselves in a box for example laws of physics who the fuck said that who tell me that who who wrote laws of physics who says who says laws of physics mean fucking anything how the fuck do you know how the fuck do you know how you say oh laws of physics right the laws of physics says that oh a ufo can't shoot from 9500 miles that way to 9500 miles this way in two seconds scientists mind would say oh that's the laws of physics Ooh, the laws of physics doesn't 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 support that you are the one who created the law because you because because of philosophers and physicists and shit in the past they say oh well you know the apple dropped from the tree and it bounced off his head and yes so we know oh gravity cool 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 story cool story i'm not even saying you're wrong i'm saying cool story how you know you're right though they say oh yeah you know the earth has a, has this density and it, it sits as like on like you like a like me sitting here on this on this couch like uh, the earth just bends and and it's like is on a, the earth is on a blanket and you know all of these all of these other earth all of these other planets are just on the same blanket and they're they're easily not you know because of gravity they're not pulling on to each other they're not they're not clashing into each other all right yeah cool story you because you know this right well you know uh, well, a whole bunch of smart people came together and you know uh, we did all that and we did all this and we came together and we wrote the book and we said yeah there's laws and this is the law all right cool cool story bro you went up there right oh yeah we went up there yeah we went up there okay cool now look i'm not even i'm not the one i'm not the guy 
to be like Earth is flat. I don't believe that. Is it a possibility? I don't know. I don't really believe that. I'm not one to say that I'm completely right. This is all opinionated, okay? But I believe the earth is round. You know, it's a spear. I believe that. You know? I've seen a whole bunch of fucking uh, SpaceX freaking rocket, sh rocket uh, shots up into space. Like, you know, you can just watch that shit on YouTube. The earth is right there, you know? It looks like a big-ass fucking spear to me, bro. You know, I, I watched, supposedly, you know, uh, SpaceX, where did they go? Oh, man, they went far, didn't they? Uh, where did they go? Was it, they sent, did they send people to, they didn't send people to Mars yet. They didn't send people to Mars yet. I know that they sent people to the space station. Was it a space station? It was a space station. So, yeah, yeah. That's the first time that SpaceX shot people off to the, off to the space station. And uh, even watching that shit. Now, that shit, that shit, okay. I'm not saying, no, oh, it's fake or nothing like that. But that shit was definitely weird. Definitely weird weird okay i don't know what to think about space because i'm not there i went skydiving i've been on an airplane that's as high that's all i know that's all i've seen that's all i know i've seen them shoot things up on spacex i guess uh on YouTube. Okay, cool. You see them shot mad satellites. All right, cool. You see it. I'm not one to say though. I don't think that there's a possibility of a hollow earth. I think that's a possibility. I don't know what's on the South Pole or the North Pole. I haven't been there. I don't know if there's a, you know, a big ass cave that, you know, just keeps going down and all of a sudden you find the lost city of Atlantis still thriving or some shit. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Maybe, maybe dinosaurs still exist. I don't know. Maybe there's a doorway. I don't, I don't feel like that's not a bad possibility i think of king kong and uh and godzilla you know maybe there's an entrance in the middle of the ocean that's true that's that's areas we never traversed maybe that's where the aliens are coming from maybe you know that's that's something that's actual you don't have to look like an idiot to say that now because bruh tch, the evidence is right there now signed, sealed, and fucking stamped and approved, bruh. So, we don't gotta worry about thinking that aliens don't exist no more. We are here now. We just waiting on when the fuck we gonna see these motherfuckers. Or maybe have they already seen them? Are they just waiting for us to be like, yo, can y'all niggas evolve yet? We gonna talk about evolution next. If you guys are here, if you guys like this, I'll do more. I like this. I like this.